Hey everybody, Dave here, Site Operations Director of Blinko Glass. Welcome you to Blinko's Festival of Glass 2020. We wish you were here with us. We really, really do. Typically this time of year, we'd have uh, dozens of lovely humans about uh, taking classes and, and partaking in the uh, history that is Blinko. Uh, however, we're coming to you digitally this year. Uh, we're coming to you from the Architecture Department. Uh, I'm here with Mr. Alex Burdett, who is in charge of the Architecture Department, to talk about some new product offerings that we have lined up for you this year. Alex, tell us what you got. Well, something Architectural Department really does a lot in is sheet glass. And traditionally, this is what one of our sheets look like. Uh, big sheet, a little overwhelming for people, especially if they've never worked in it. If you're a professional, this is what you're used to working in, but we want to take the opportunity and pass it on to anyone who's interested because glass is such a unique art style that not everyone really has, like you said, access to. Mm -hmm. So we're introducing this year our hobby kits. This is the example of our rainbow colors. As you see, it gives five different colors. Each set will have five panes of glass in it. Each of them are cut to this nine by seven, uh, easy to handle, easy to work with. Uh, and then from there, like I said, the rainbow set, and then we'll also have a breakout set of each one of these. So you can get five sheets of each one of these colors. So you've got your greens, your turquoise, your blues, your yellows, and your oranges. Very cool. What about crystal? Uh, we also, we do offer crystal. Uh, it's going to be similar to this, just a little smaller. Gotcha. Okay. So instead of having to order uh, large quantities of sheet glass, have to worry about freight shipping and showing up on a semi truck. Um, you know, that's probably fine for the, you know, the architectural pros, yeah. but this is very much for the hobbyists and the DIY crowd, right? Yep. We're going to, we got it packaged up real nice here, put it in a box, ground ship that right to your door. Cool. So this will show right up at your door instead of having a semi truck uh, and very affordable as well, right? So what price point are these going to come in at? So a kit like this, like I said, five panes of glass is going to be $89 plus shipping and tax. Okay. And tell me again, what uh, sizes these are? So they're all cut to this nine by seven. Gotcha. Okay. And so tell me Alex, um, so let's say I, I want to try my hand at some glass art. Maybe I want to make some wind chimes or perhaps a, uh, a nightlight. How would I even do that? It shows up my door. Now what? So you've got very limited number of tools that you need. Mm -hmm. This is what I start with. This is what I work with almost every day. There's a little glass cutter. It's got this little rotary blade on it. You take it, you'll score the glass and then it kind of snaps. You can do it on anything. You can take that glass. And I think we've got some examples of it where you score it right down the middle. You can literally take it on the corner and pop it and it'll just snap right in half, right on that mark. Uh, if you're getting a little more in, into it, you can get some other tools like these. This is what I use on like the big sheets. You take these, put them right on that line, squeeze it, and it puts a pressure and cracks it right down the middle. Very cool. Yeah. So if you wanted to patch maybe a garage window or maybe even liven up a, a regular window by gluing things and applying it to it, uh, really and truly, it's, uh, the only limit is your imagination. Absolutely. Uh, so at this price point and with the ground shipping, you can now uh, have access to uh, a, a wide range of colors and all sorts of new ideas to uh, stay busy at home with those of you who are locked in at home and in a lockdown as I hope that you are um, so if you have you know ideas or surely you got some time to uh, do some uh, hobby projects around the house great time to learn a new skill that's right um, so we talked about some sheet glass um, and I want to kind of maybe take a moment and talk about how we actually make this sheet glass yeah absolutely so I've got an example right here a couple behind us so this it's how it starts. They take the hot glass right out of the furnace, put it into a mold, and blow these big tubes. Uh, and traditionally, when they start, they've got these caps on them, and we cut them off. We score down the side, and then it goes through another process where it's flattened. So they'll take these tubes, they'll stick it in there, and while it starts to warm up, they'll have some guys in there work it and really open it up. And when it's done, you get one of these lovely sheets. Very cool. So the same uh, techniques that we use to make the, the vases and bowls and everything else that uh, you've known Blinko for, we apply in this architectural format, blow a giant bubble of sorts, mm -hmm. cut it, score it, slap it in the annealing oven, wait till it falls apart, and then we have uh, beautiful sheet glass.